Hi, and welcome. This is a tutorial about how to loop a specific section of a YouTube video. Looping a specific section, a small section, is so good for your practicing. It will help your practicing. It will make your practicing more efficient and uh, make it better overall. Uh, and this is a simple way to do it using YouTube because so much music is there uh, to practice from and scores like this raised theme. Uh, score play from Hal Leonard for string orchestra. So the first thing is to go over to the Chrome Web Store. You can just type Chrome Web Store in the search here. And then the next thing you're going to type here in the search engine at the Web Store is Looper. And this is the one I've used. I've used it. I deleted it so that I could add it back in this tutorial, but I've used it for several years now. It's a great extension. I'm going to click Add to Chrome. And it's going to ask me again to make sure, confirm, add extension. Great. And now it's been added. This little green bar shows you what extensions you've added to Chrome here. All right. Now, if I refresh my page, of course, it starts to autoplay here. Ah, there it is, right there. It says loop. And what it's. Oh, there we go. already started up so actually I was practicing with this um, and you can see 43 seconds to 108 my apologies the internet's going in and out here um, so 43 to 1 I actually saved my uh, loop from the last time before I deleted it to add it back at any rate so say uh, you're practicing a specific section you want to get it better or you're maybe practicing for a playing test um, I just want to find the section that I'm looking for so 43 seconds to 1 8 lines up with this measure 19 uh, over here to the end of this is around 26 or 27 I believe uh, this section right here let's just listen to it and what you're gonna notice is it's gonna go from let me back it up and you see, no matter what I do, it starts at uh, 43 seconds. And so it's going to play to the end. You see it jumped back there to 43 seconds when it got to one minute and eight seconds. And it's keeping tally over here played one time, all right? I cannot tell you how powerful this is for your practice to loop something. So if you find you know, any video, tutorial video, a score play like this, or a live orchestra playing the piece that you're trying to learn, get this extension, use the loop feature. Um, and you can even use this loop for 10 times. All right, to force yourself to play it for several repetitions. All right, that's the looper tool. Leave a comment, let me know what you think, and uh, happy practicing.